some of the updates that are coming as part of Respond 3.0. Respond 3.0 is a complete rewrite of the Respond CMS as well as the sites produced by the application. Um, rather than being in Knockout and PHP, Respond 3.0 is a single page application powered by AngularJS. Um, the look and feel hasn't changed much since Respond 2. Uh, if you notice, the login page looks much the same, as does the create page. Um, the difference really is in the speed of the application and then some of the capabilities that Angular enables. So I'm going to log in really quick to the application. As you notice, the, log, the login is really quick. Switching between page types is really quick as well. Um, when you load an existing page into the editor, the editor responds almost immediately, whereas in the past there's a little bit of loading. Um, this is just really a function of Angular. The editor works much the same way it does in the past. You can still drag and drop content onto the screen. and when you save and publish it, the app will respond with the updates. In this example, we're adding a map to the About Us page, and that was relatively easy. Um, one of the cool new features of Angular in Respond 3.0 is that the featured content has been replaced by um, this block. And basically, the difference between Angular and Knockout was that in Knockout, we would load the uh, data asynchronously. Whereas in Angular, since it's a single page app, we can use this function called ng-include to just include pages so they behave just like they would, um, just like they were part of the page. So just as an example, this isn't going to look very good, but I'm going to include the contact form on the About page. And when I hit Save and Publish, you'll notice that, and refresh the About page, you'll notice that the Contact Us form is now there. Um, there's no loading, the, the change is instantaneous, and that's really a feature of uh, what's capable in Respond 3 versus Respond 2.11. Um, that's about it. I will have more videos and more examples uh, as I get more stuff done as part of Respond 3. Um, in the meantime, look for it on GitHub. Plan to publish a version sometime in the next couple weeks. Um, and if you have any questions, feel free to email me at matt at matthewsmith.com or contact me via the forum or the contact us link on responsecms.com.